this is Manabu Farms, reminding you, be productive with the space you have around you. Stop growing grass and grow some food. Feed the community around you. All right, everybody. This here is one of our radish, and I say one of our radish pits or beds. And I'm going to grab a couple, hopefully, radishes here to take today to the elderly that I build. Go and cook for every day, seven days a week. I cook dinner for them, and on the weekends, I also cook breakfast. And it looks like I see one that's decent. Let's see about this guy here. Oh, those are because they're clustered so close together, they're all growing in small. We'll take one of them here just so the other ones can hopefully get a little bigger. Well, this is the oldest bin of radishes right now because we, as I said in some of those earlier videos, we stopped growing for about six months because we were told we were going to have to have a parking lot. There we go. That's another little nice one. Alrighty. Some of our dill. Some of our mint. A strange berry plant. Well, I've got you here on camera real quick. You see these little green berries? Well, they turn black like this. There we go. Let's look at that. A nice black berry. That is, appears to be edible. Has a green tomato like seeds inside of it and it volunteered up here and I'll be honest for the first part of its life I thought it was a tomatillo it's obviously not a tomatillo so uh, please if you know what this berry plant is let us know so I know if I can start eating these things all right some more of our cabbage and peppers and our oregano and basils and mints and some roses there and some holy basil some thyme anyways I've got to run off and feed some people but I just wanted to make sure I got some sort of update out to you guys today well, let me show you real quick while I get up here here's some of our zucchinis coming in and then this here is stevia that we grow to replace sugar some tomatoes an actual tomatillo the ones that look like grass here growing along the border are actually popcorn strawberries which are neither a corn nor a strawberry so try looking those ones up and then some bush beans and some green beans all right guys this is carl out at manabu farms reminding you true freedom starts with food freedom